We're going to get the schema design a little bit later in this course, but I wanted to just introduce some of the questions that arise when you're designing a document-oriented schema. With relational, it's pretty straightforward to design the schema. You typically go for the third normal form, and then maybe you combine a few things. But with MongoDB and document-oriented designs, how do you know whether to embed or not? You know, for example, in the schema that we finally decided on for this problem, the posts collection had a tags array right inside it. And the tags array had tag names that potentially might be duplicated across the different posts. So why embed that versus put it into a separate tags collection? You have the same question for the comments. Why did we embed those versus have them in a separate collection? And the answer is because they're typically accessed at the same time you access the posts. It's very rare that you would need to access the tags independently of accessing a post or access the comments independently of accessing a post. And the comment itself doesn't apply to more than one post. Now, it is true in the case of the tags, and this is, let's say, cycling and this is running, that if we wanted to change the word cycling to biking in every single post, that would be kind of tedious since we, it's not relationally connected. But this is an unusual change to make, something you're not going to make all the time. And so it makes sense that you would put these tags directly in to the post collection itself. And generally, when you're deciding whether to embed or not to embed, it's going to be the way you access the data that's going to guide that along with some other practical considerations. For example, a MongoDB document can't be more than 16 megabytes. So if you were going to have more than 16 megabytes of comments, which would be extremely unusual, then you'd have to put the comments themselves into a separate collection. So now it's time for a quiz. In which scenario is it impossible to embed data within a document? That is, in which scenario do you have to put the data in a separate collection? Check all that apply.